how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. Welcome back. So today I thought I would go ahead and share with you guys a uh, video of items that I had purchased or items that were sent to me um, by a company or just someone um, in general. So I thought I'd go ahead and just show you what I got. And I was trying to do a video the one day showing you what my in-laws had sent me over from England. And that video just never panned out. It just... <laughs> the sound quality and everything just nothing was working so I did do just a recent video on these two products here they had sent me um, so if you'd like a more in-depth and hear more about these items it's uh, from bourgeois it's the healthy mix foundation um, and then the healthy mix concealer they had sent these to me and I did do a review um, on these two products so if you want to hear more I'll put the link down below to that. The next item that they had sent me from Bourgeois was two lip stains, which I do have the one on, and I did put like a little gloss on top just to kind of give it a little extra something. Um, but these are the uh, Rouge Edition, the Rouge Edition Velvets, or the number's four, and this one is in the number five. And unfortunately, I bet you what happened is it's like one of them things where you take the wrapper off and the shade comes off, what the name of it is. But this one is in number five. It's more of a pinky red tone. And the peach one's uh, four, oh four. They just, they glide on and so pigmented. Like there's the peach one. There's the red shade down below there. But you can see what I mean, like the texture. Oh my gosh, it's just lovely. Then I got a couple items from Sleek. One being this um, eye and cheek palette. It's called Midsummer's Dream. And you get a couple items in there like that. It has, you know, several different blushes. Like a couple blushes on each end there and some eyeshadows. So really, really pretty um, shades in there. And the one blush is like rose gold, which I think I do have originally because I, I do have some of the blushes from Sleep. They're really nice. The other one that's here is Del Mar Limited Edition Volume 2. I did want the first one, but I guess he couldn't get that, so I got the second one. And it's from the Eye Divine eyeshadows. This is more summer kind of colors, I think. Um, but it's very pretty. There's some real pretty shades in here. And the lighting definitely is not doing it justice. But very pretty. Very pretty colors. Next thing from Bourgeois. I forgot my uh, in-laws that got me. It's, it was a kit. And it was like a summer kit. So you got a bronzer. A nice big bronzer from Bourgeois, which their bronzers are really nice. You got one of these lip pencils. It's Peach on a Beach is the shade. That's a real pretty, real pretty peach shade. Pretty pigmented. Um, reminds you of the Revlon, which is down here, Revlon uh, lipsticks. You got a little Kabuki brush. And like I said, the bronzer, now there's some shimmer to it, but the shimmer doesn't come on, doesn't rub off on the face. And um, there's something about the bronzers that just smells so nice. I don't know what it is, but there's the bronzer shade there. And there it is on my hand right there. Pretty nice shade. I really like their bronzers. They've worked really nice for me. Here's the shocker. Here was the shocker to me um, that I got. And it's so funny because I was just talking about, I was just talking about this palette in, um, in another video. And this palette here that my in-laws had sent me is the L'Oreal La Palette Nude Rose. So this is their La Palette and it's Nude Rose. And here's the shades. Now, this might be more like the second one from the La Palettes in L'Oreal here. Um, there's some shades here that I notice were different than the ones that we 
have at ours, but um, I'm not sure how well you're going to see like this shade right there is a real pretty uh, peachy kind of duochrome shade and I'm not sure how well you will see it because the one problem I feel with these palettes um, the quality is kind of okay you know right there you can see right here see a little bit of the duochrome but not much but anyway on top of it all I mean obviously when you've seen that you see what I mean the big difference you know the big difference like here's ours and here's theirs you know so that's pretty crazy in itself I'm not really feeling the La Palette anyway the L'Oreal La Palette's they're just okay I'm not really not very whatever over the, I'm not over the moon with them I guess is what I'm saying the next item was the company uh, Proganics they had sent me some more stuff some more shampoos and things to try and some other items in there and I did do a video it was Proganics it was quench was the name it was the name um, and so they sent me these here and what it is it, okay yeah this is for uh, color hair color like when you color your hair it's an anti-fade when you color your hair it's supposed to help it not fade so quickly um, I haven't really got a chance to really try them because I haven't colored my hair in a while so um, I have a shampoo and conditioner so shampoo and conditioner and then the other thing is a spray uh, weightless argon oil and it is also it's to help protect from the sun uh, it's to help keep your hair the color you know more vibrant longer and last longer and then the other items this is my little card here the other items they sent me um, was some items for my hair for to put in my hair and I was gonna wear the one item it was um, be the queen of the pumpkin patch I'm gonna because th I think it came in October when I got this um, but this is called a bun clip so it's called a bun clip if you can see that right in there looks like a little crown you know like a little bun clip my kitsch my kitsch kitsch k-i-t-s-c-h I'll put the link down below I'm not gonna get paid for it or anything like that I'm not affiliated or getting paid for it but I'll put the link down below because like maybe you might want to see some of these um, accessory things and stuff or order some maybe you might see something you might like so I'll put the link down below to them but it's a button clip so yeah you can put it like right in the middle like if you put your bun up and you put it right in the middle here and put it the crown of your uh, hair there um, the next thing I got some of them uh, pony wrap strands which I love these things anyway again see as you can see k-i-t-s-c-h is who these came from I'm not sure if they're affiliated with them but they're handmade with love but yeah I love these ties they are awesome so that's gonna come in handy for sure um, the next thing I've never tried one of these so but it says give a messy bun added flare with a head turning just clip on both sides of bun and you're done chain there and everything I've never used anything like that so I'll try it out and see uh, a head wrap they gave me a head wrap so you know I hope. Um, of course I got my cute little basket it says about the basket so which I like because I could put some stuff in there I didn't get the travel brush so I don't know what happened there because it says I should have a travel brush here but I didn't and then this I got one of these cute little hair clips and it looks like a little alligator kind of a thing and I've seen some others talk about these um, I only got one in here so if I was supposed to get any more I don't know but it says uh, now blow drying hair is a breeze so you can kind of clip up your hair I guess in certain sections if you want to this would be handy for a lot of things like you know curling your hair and certain sections and everything so 
I figured I'll give that all a try. And then the next products, um, these were sent to me from Pure Minerals, which I have gotten stuff from Pure Minerals before. And I've been using it, so I will I will have a review up at some point here. I'm not quite sure when because I have used it um, close to about almost a week now. So, but it's from Pure Minerals and it's the Cameo Cameo Contour. Now I got light and medium here. It comes with a sponge, like one of them kind of beauty blender sponges. Um, so you got one side here that you can use a foundation highlight and then the other side you use as like contouring and you know they're inside there and you draw so I'll, I'll do a review I'm not gonna go discussing anything right now but I'll have a review up and uh, even do a demonstration so you can see thank you to Pro Proganics and Pure Minerals I'll get to play around with some things. Went ahead and picked up another Lunier Intense Eyeliner. I do really love this eyeliner for the top part whenever I'm doing my, uh, eye, my eyelining on top and I do like it to be mostly black. Then I went ahead and I got another the Super Sizer from CoverGirl but I did get the um, Star Wars the Star Wars collection one. There you go. As you can see, I ended up getting one of the Star Wars lipsticks. This one is considered the nude shade. Um, it was in number 70. It doesn't really say, it just has a number on the bottom. I wish I would have gotten the red shade. If it's still there, I might get that one. But this is the nude shade. They're supposed to be the nude shade. The other ones were a little too wild crazy for me and just I wasn't feeling them. So um, this one here I thought would be nice. You can do in the summertime too with a look you know or top it on something but uh, right there it is you know see it gives a nice effect you know so I thought I would get it and plus I love Star Wars I am one of them who does enjoy Star Wars um so the next thing I got another lipstick and I got one of my uh, Maybellines and I believe these are the matte yeah, this is from the matte collection, the creamy mattes, and I wanted the, what is this, blushing pout, 682 blushing pout. I believe on my video where I did my beautiful browns, this is the shade I put on my lips that I was like, oh yeah, I'm feeling it. I don't know why I smell them. Don't ask. I, I, I'm weird like that. But here's the shade here. It's called, what did I say it was? Blushing pout? Yes. Gorgeous shade. I love it. Look at that pretty shade. So there it is there. Hard Candy came out with their highlighters. Um, it's Just Glow and it says Baked Illuminating Duo is what it is. This is the boxing thing it came in. Now the one I got is in Candlelit and then there's another one. The Candlelit is more lighter shade and the other one is more a little bit more darker shades but I, th I think we I could get away with the other ones too um, here they are here they're just like the um, you know how their bronzers are and everybody likes that tiki glow or whatever that one is and some of their bronzers and everything it, it's just like those um, and you know there's one on each side and it comes in this compact there's a mirror there brush there what i like about these and i've been using this like crazy a lot lately these remind me and i feel like i'm repeating myself on some items to a degree on on this product but again ambient powders the all famous ambient powders that's out there from hourglass they remind me because like this shade here which, let me see, I don't know if it tells you which shade's which, really. I, I guess not. This one's a, a little bit more lighter, this shade here. And this one here, I can take and dip my brush in and just put all over on my face. And it just gives a, a nice hint of a glow. It doesn't give you like disco ball-y kind of stuff or anything like that. I mean, it's just very finely I mean, I don't even know if you're going to see. It's, it's more of a glow 
it gives you than anything. The other one is just a little more um, of a glow to it, but not much more. So you can do both of them the same way. I'm fair complected, and I totally can do both of them with all over on my face. Like if I want to put it all over, and it sets real nice, and it gives a nice uh, subtle glow. Okay, and then the last thing is I ordered from Sephora. I didn't get the VIB Rouge 20% thing. Um, I did just today get my $20 off card. I will use that. For my my bonus, my points, I got Pop of Passion, Bare Minerals Pop of Passion. I got one of these. I wanted to try them out and see. And it's a lip oil balm. And it's totally my shade. I can totally see that. Uh, Plumberry is what it says. So, oh yeah. So I'll be feeling that one. So there's Plumberry. Looks like a very pretty shade. We'll go ahead and... Hmm. Looks very moisturizing. Right there it is. So, okay, and then the items that I actually ordered was... It's... I have it on my eyes right now. I don't know how well you can really see. I have it on my eyes right now, and it is the Anastasia self-made um, palette because I really loved the other palette very much. And so I wanted to get this palette then too, and it was like 35 bucks, and I thought that wasn't too bad. And I'm so glad I got it because there's such a nice variety of shades in here um, with that nice brush. And it is just gorgeous. I know so many people have been showing it. Um, wow, can you just, you can see that purple just, and that is what I do have on the one end of my eyes, along with Treasure, which Treasure is such a gorgeous color. It's in the inner, inner through the middle. I worked it in. Um... The only shades in here that I can see that kind of are semi-matte, but not, well, there's one maybe matte shade, which is hot chocolate. Buttery is kind of a semi, maybe matte. The rest are all pretty much shimmer. Sherbert might be considered satin matte, I don't know, or however you want to call it. But there it is there, it's so pretty. I was watching uh, makeup fun with Olivia. I will put a link down below to her channel. Love watching her. She's very um, energetic, very sweet lady. I just, I love watching her. She just is always smiling and always upbeat. Sephora Ombre, Sephora Ombre Obsession palette, and it's a blush palette for $34 is how much it is. So look how big this disc is, first of all. Like, Seriously, look, and it's pretty. You know, the outside packaging is so pretty. But that's just crazy to me how big it is. Look at the, don't want you to get blinded, but look at all them shades. In the middle is the highlight. That's a highlight. Oh my God. Just look how many blushes you got there. I mean, the camera is not going to do it justice again. This is one of them ones that you really need to see up in person because this shade down here and you're not going to see it is almost duochrome this shade i can totally see me wearing for summertime but there's that beautiful hot pink then there's some purple berry tones up here and oh my goodness so all right so the highlights in the middle okay look at that do you see that that is crazy all right and then there it is on my hand can you see that? Right there it is. Do you see that highlight? I mean, seriously, that is crazy. 34 bucks for this thing here is yes. I mean, like there's bronzy shades, peachy shades, pink shades, plum shades. That highlight is a killer. Anyway, beauties, thanks so much for joining me. I hope you liked the video and enjoyed. And if you did, give me a thumbs up. So much appreciate that very much. It would help me out a lot. And go ahead and like the video. Also, if you are not subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you. You can join me each week and join me on anything beauty related. It just depends on uh, what's going on for me that week. And um, as always, beauties, please do remember to just be yourself. Love yourself and let the real beauty shine through. So until the next time, 
Y'all take care and I will see you then. Take care, everybody. Mwah. I love you all. Bye-bye.